A Central Texas family will soon say goodbye to a very crowded house and hello to the new brand new custom built home. It's all part of a new partnership with Habitat for Humanity and the City of Waco and Fox 44's Noelle Mendoza shows us how today's work is going to ensure a better future for this family. The Rodriguez family will finally have a place to call their own thanks to the Raise the Roof project, a partnership between Habitat for Humanity and the City of Waco. The City of Waco employees are hammering, connecting, and lifting to build the perfect home for Claudia, Jose, and their 13-year-old daughter, Fatima. We're very excited and thankful uh, to all the people that are helping out here at our construction site today. For the past 10 years, the Rodriguez family has been living with family members in a home already filled with six people. It does make it tough for folks to get into affordable housing, and that's what uh, Habitat for Humanity does for the city of Waco. It was no easy feat. The application process alone takes about about 90 days, then a 12 to 18 month long process to learn about home ownership and 300 hours of sweat equity. The equity that they put into the home is by uh, is by learning about home ownership and actually building homes. So they do 300 hours of sweat equity. When their home is finished, then they purchase that home through a zero interest mortgage. Their payments for what will be their new three bedroom, one and a half bath home will be about $420 a month. So it really does make home ownership affordable and accessible for families that may not have the opportunity otherwise. Today about 30 city employees are working. They'll continue to do so every day this week like a regular 8 to 5 job. So they get to come out here work on a site all day and help us build one of our homes. The home should be completed in about three to four months. Uh, seeing the family here and at the house dedications is what makes uh, Habitat work worth it. all the all the uh, blood, sweat, and tears that goes into it. They're still looking for volunteers. I'll have that information up on our website, centexproud.com. In Waco, Noelle Mendoza, Fox 44 News.